I got ready happily thinking about meeting my childhood friend Meera who is coming from abroad with her husband. I am now waiting for Junk to come and take me to a house. As I was waiting, suddenly Jungkook came and was staring at me. I blushed as he held my hand. I was about to say, but suddenly he kissed my cheeks. You are so beautiful, Vyan. I can't take my eyes from you. He said, smiling as you blushed. Jungkook, stop. Let us go, or else we will be late. Jungkook, you know my friend Meera also has a beautiful daughter. She is so sweet. You said smiling. Yen, when will I get my child from you? He asked, parking as you blush even more. Jungkook, you shouted embarrassedly as he smiled. Let us go. He smiled as you were about to go, but suddenly, suddenly my phone rang. I answered the call. It was a wrong number. I ended the call. As I looked around, I saw no one was with me. Jungkook still haven't arrived. It was all a dream. Ah, why end? It was all a dream. Jungkook still haven't arrived. Jungkook, my husband, who is cold and ignore me every time as we got arranged marriage. I fell for him, but he, I don't know. Why end? You must know that Jungkook will not come even you inform him before. I was about to lose hope, but suddenly my phone vibrated. It was Jungkook message. I smiled, opening it. I know Jungkook is cold, but he will not be that cold. I smiled, opening my phone and saw the message. My smile dropped. Why end? I can't take you as I have a lot of work. I took a long breath. Jungkook must have a lot of work, so he didn't come. I thought to myself and left the house alone. I arrived at Meera's house. I was greeted by her family. I smiled as I saw her husband caring for her. I wish Jungkook to be like him. I started to talk with Meera. Why, Yen? I missed you so much. She started to hug you. I missed you too. You said, hugging her back as her daughter came towards you. Oma, see my drawing. She said as you both fell for her cuteness. I enjoyed talking with Meera and playing with her daughter. I forgot everything as I talked. As time passed by, I smiled, hugged her back, and left. I arrived at our house and saw Jungkook working in his laptop, working in office, working in home. I can't with him. I went towards the bed and went to sleep. Next morning, I woke up and saw Jungkook was in a shower. As I was about to get up, suddenly doorbell rang. I got up and went towards the door. I saw Jungkook. As I opened the door, I saw a woman calling for Jungkook. Jungkook came down and she suddenly hugged him, making me jealous. I fake a cough to make them separate. Vyan, she is Sana, my business partner. Sana, she is Vyan, my wife. Vyan, 
she has come here to work as we are working in a project it is a important project she came early he said as you gave a death stare at sana as he said i was giving death stare at her who was looping at my husband if she is a business partner why must she had come here in home you thought while plouting I saw Jungkook sitting with that Sana on the couch and started to work. I thought to make breakfast in the kitchen and bring something to Jungkook to eat. As I was working, I saw Sana standing at me. I ignored it. As I was about to finish, suddenly I saw Sana was so close to me and was about to kiss me. What the hell? I was about to push her harshly but suddenly I heard glass breaking. I turned to see Wayan who put the foot plate on the ground as her eyes was about to cry. I was about to explain to her but she ran to the room crying. I shouted to the Sana and told her to get out. As she left, I went towards the room to see Wayan. I ran to the room crying. Jango, how can you do this? I loved you but you you were cold by accepted it. As I was sleeping suddenly Jango entered the room. Wayan, I want to talk. He said but you stopped him. What do you want to talk more? I saw everything. So you bought her to spend time with her in front of me, right? How can you do this to me Jungkook? No Wayan, you got it wrong. Let me explain. He said raising his voice. Now you are shouting at me that I got it wrong. I love you but you always cold towards me, ignored me. I thought you need some time but you As he shouted at me I felt scared as I thought of before incident I took a long breath crying non stop I don't know what to tell more Janko are you using me you shouted crying as he got angry I shouted at him as tears dropped from my eyes I saw him getting more angry and was about to hit me. I closed my eyes thinking about before incident but suddenly I am trying to explain to her but she is not ready to listen. As she said that I never used her. I can't express my feeling. I was about to hit but stop seeing her crash. When he was about to hit me I remembered how my ex boyfriend hit me every day I got scared closing my eyes walking back crying but he stopped I stopped seeing her then I saw scratch on her whole body I was shocked as tears dropped from my eyes I saw her looking at me scared I'm sorry He asked nervously but you didn't respond. This is given by my ex-boyfriend. He always hit me. Then I got arranged marriage with you. I was so happy as I fell for you. But as you were about to hit me, I remembered you said crying. I'm so sorry Wayan first Sana was about to kiss me I was about to push her away but suddenly you came there's nothing between me and Sana I'm so sorry I never wanted to hit you I just got angry when you said that I'm sorry for being cold and ignoring you I can't express my feeling because of my ex girlfriend who cheated on me before From that day Wayan didn't say anything and went to her friend house 
as she needs some time to think as she left i started to miss her badly and think how vyan felt this way too i say every time sorry to her and started to fell for her vyan is different from others as i missed her badly every day days to months pass one month later After one month, Vyan is coming back to our house. I am so happy decorating the whole house. I smile seeing Vyan entering while being blindfolded by me. I was so happy coming back to our house. I smiled as he opened the blindfold. I saw the whole house was decorated beautifully. I saw Jungkook holding my hand making me sit. Vyan I am so happy as you came back to me. I am sorry for my mistake. I love you so much. I can't live without you. I miss you every day. I am so happy to come back. I am also sorry. I must have listened to you. I love you, Jungkook. We then kissed.